Guys, it's been a long night. I know you're tired. It's 7.04. <laughs> when will this long fucking nightmare end? How are we ever gonna get an Uber out of this hellhole that is not really Beverly Hills, not really West Hollywood, just a sad, sad triangle <laughs> in the center of hell. As a director and an actor, I know I can't do anything without writers. And as a writer, I know I can't do anything without cocaine. I don't know why I said that out loud. <laughs> That's crazy, it's 2020. No one's doing cocaine anymore. We're all doing Adderall. <laughs> so legal, so free. Here are the nominees for writing outstanding on-air promos. And that's right, when I say on-air, I want to remind you we need to respect these people because their writing is on the air and this entire award show, which will end before 8 p.m., Mom, is not. <laughs> and the nominees are. And the Writers Guild Award goes to, I mean, just like check your lift. Is it seven minutes? Is it four minutes? We don't know. Just take a look. But not before this woman accepts her award. Jessica Katzenstein for Star Trek McCartan. All right. Jessica gets here. Oh, wow, okay. It's like a dream and a nightmare all at once. Okay. Um, um, uh, just want to thank the WGA for honoring this category. I know a lot of people in this room probably think that marketing is the necessary evil. Uh, but what can I say? That's where I've always felt most at home. So... <laughs> Um, I want to thank uh, everybody at CBS Marketing, and especially my boss, uh, my bosses, Garen Vandebeek and Lori Sheffa, uh, for creating a place where we can all do uh, amazing and creative work. And I also want to thank my fellow nominees, Molly and Br Ralph. You uh, inspire me and make me uh, more creative every day, so thank you so much. And to my partner in this world, Bill, uh, I couldn't do anything without you, so thank you so much. <laughs> all right, this is for you. Yay. Bye.